<laughs> uh, welcome back to what I've been calling o an OCD Gamer Plays Assassin's Creed. Um, we're actually, believe it or not, beginning the end of Assassin's Creed 1. Like, officially hitting the end, believe it or not. Um, Howie, you're in the Discord. Um, could you do me a favor and check the audio and make sure it's all good? Let's I'm not too loud, not too quiet. You seem pretty all right. All right, that's good. That's good. Actually, yeah, your your volume uh, with everything matched maxed out, it's uh, matching the uh, the Discord volume. Awesome, awesome. Okay. Um. Oh, and hello to uh, Science and Yvonne. Glad you both could stop by. Um. Let me mute my phone so you guys don't hear my annoying ass notifications whenever I get texts or anything. Uh, <laughs> all right. Um, make sure you take a second and hydrate because hydration is important. Take a second, stretch your back and shoulders and neck, relax your jaw or whatever else you're currently clenching without necessarily realizing it. How's everyone's day going? It's a holiday, right? I'm so out of touch with the days. Uh, Labor Day, right? That's the holiday today? Indeed, it is Labor Day. So, that explains why why science is here as early as he is. <laughs> Normally, he'd be working right right now. Um, so, today's stream uh, will be going probably a bit long, most likely a bit longer than usual. Uh, because, in, because I'm so so close to the end of the game. Uh, in addition to the current memory sequence we're on, there's some modern day stuff that will get done for the main storyline, as well as some more anima, some more anima stuff. And it basically, from what I remember, there's not enough of that last segment that's after the anything after this specific memory segment that um, would fill up a whole stream on its own. So we're, we're just going to push through to the end. I got as much done as I could uh, before today. Uh, I've got all of the... I have, believe it or not, all of the flags, all the viewpoints, and everything. All the Templars, everything. Literally all that's left is storyline. Um, when I started this, I had initially intended on doing all of that in stream as well. However... Uh, this game specifically makes it a bit monotonous to watch. Um, it's less so in later games. So, like, in the next game that I go on to, Assassin's Creed 2, I will be doing a bit more of that as I go along, rather than, uh, how I've been doing it in this game. Because what I do, what I generally do in this game when I play it is, before I do any of the storyline or missions, I just go through, clear out all of the collectibles, and then go on with the storyline. Uh, I do it all at once. Whereas with Assassin's Creed 2, it's a bit easier to just uh, to just do it as you go, based entirely on the fact that whenever you see collectibles and stuff, they're easier to track because they actually mark them in the map. Go figure. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, I've got all those done, um, and we'll be getting into it. Let me put my discord back on top so that I can actually see discord and twitch chat there we go helps helps if I can ha see the disc the twitch chat too doesn't it ha! okay um I guess we're good to go I believe yeah um I've, I've mentioned this uh, real quick I've mentioned this the last couple of times I I have started streams. I have a link tree now, because apparently I think I'm that important <laughs> to have a link tree. Uh, it has links to all my socials, my, uh, my social medias, as well as links to Yvonne, Matt, uh, and Eternity's Twitch streams, Twitch channels. Um, it also has uh, some crisis, uh, re uh, crisis resources for the United States. Um, which exist other where, uh, other places, it's just I'm in the United States, and, yeah, anyway. Um, and, 
so that is down below in the Twitch chat. It's all, or if you're watching this on YouTube, <clears throat> excuse me. Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube later, it will be down below in the YouTube description as well. Um, and yeah, it also has. I, I think I, I don't remember if I said this or not, but it also has my Discord in it. You ha do I have a bot on my channel to manage things? Not a spammer. Manage what things, Yvonne? No, I don't have a bot. Uh, I have auto mod, but I don't have a bot. Unless that is a bot, then I have a bot. <laughs> um, I'm not sure what you mean by a bot to manage things, or what things would be should be managed. Waiting on a response from Yvonne. And she's like, okay, well, while she's, while I'm waiting on that reply, I'm going to go ahead and get into this. All right, so. We are on the hunt for Robert de Sauve, the master of the Templar, of the Knights Templar of this, of the Third Crusade. He was, like all of the other people that, uh, all of the major assassination targets, they have been real people in history. Robert de Sauve was actual was the actual leader of the actual Knights Templar during the Third Crusade of history. Because, you know, that's how it is. <laughs> that's how these games like to operate, and it's great. Um, okay, so... First Until things first... insert Connor into every single event in the Revolutionary War. Hey, that was actually pretty great. Um... I lost it at Paul Revere. That one did push it a little bit, but it was still fun. Um, but we'll get it's to that. It's meme worthy, but it is. <laughs> we'll get to that. It was an epic sequence, to be fair. Uh, it was comical. Well, I'm I mean, sorry. Paul Revere, in history, Paul Revere never did actually finish his ride. There was a point where someone else had to take over for him because of various things and so yes. like as far as i'm aware that person was never named in history no. um uh, and and like, so it's one of those things where it's like eh, yeah, there's enough if i remember correctly there's it's uh, one of those things where it's like enough of a wiggle room where paul where that would have been better if they hadn't started you with paul revere at the beginning and had paul revere bouncing around on the horse's ass I mean, saying, go left, Connor. You're going the wrong way, Connor. Oh. Every 20 seconds. It's been so long since I've actually played that sequence. I, it was terrible. I mean, to be fair, all escort quests are terrible, and that is just a and that's what that is, just a glorified escort quest. Uh, Automod is technically a bot, but you meant more. But Yvonne meant more a custom bot that can answer commonly que asked questions in chat. Uh, respond to new followers, post links when requested, etc. Uh, no, I don't have anything like that. Um, I will have to do that later. But yeah, no, I don't have anything like that. You're <laughs> anyway, um, all right, so let's, uh, let's get started. I'm hunting down Robert de Saab. Um, Let's start with this one. Yeah, I'll, I'll look at whatever it. you get to that part of that game because you want to make sure that it is actually as horrible as you remember it being. Well, yes, and also I want to 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 be there when I'm proven right. You, the thing is, you will never. The, to me, you will never be proven right because even with how with how cringy some of the aspects could be, I still love it. It's still my favorite game of the oh. series. One of my favorite games of the series. Oh, no. Like, I completely agree. Assassin's Creed 3 was phenomenal. It was... With the exception of some cringe and the, uh, the, the, the end point trying to leave some dangling loose ends, probably the, one of the stronger entrances, entries in the series. I, and at least for a single playthrough, a uh, follow-through is always rather annoying because of the whole extended uh, intro sequence. Like, you don't, right. don't even get to Connor doing things 
as an adult until, until like, later. Two, yeah. Three hours into the game. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, I don't. I know that there's at least one person in this thing who's absolute in the, in the who's watching these that has not actually watched it, is, is not familiar with any of the series. So I'm trying my best to keep later spoilers as vague or clear or absent as possible. Um, okay. In that case, I will say no more. Um, but you know what I'm on about. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, the big thing is that. Um, when I play it, I'll be playing the remaster, which I have not, which I started, but I have not actually, um, taken too much of an opportunity to actually, oops, follow through with. Um, oop, that's a guard. Do not stab the guy right in front of the guard. That's a bad thing. Generally, uh, um, stabbing people behind the guard is also rather, uh, rather bad, generally. Yeah, but only, you know, as long as they're not looking in your general direction and you get out of the area when it happens, you're, af when he actually falls over, then you're fine, you know? Let, let me rephrase. Stabbing people is generally bad. <laughs> yes. In real life, yes. Jamie had to think about that for a minute. <laughs> no, Jamie, Jamie was worrying about the massive group of guards that was standing, uh, that was walking towards him. Um, but yeah, the, when we get to Assassin's Creed 3, that, yeah, um, the big thing will be that I will have to make sure that I find a thing to make sure I get all of the different, um, what are they called? The different side quests all done in proper order and all that, just because if you miss those, assuming how they, assuming they, they didn't fix that in uh the remaster if you miss those when you're uh if you miss one when you're um in uh when you're playing three you will uh, uh you will miss crucial future things and miss uh come on me, damn it. Come on. There we go. Uh, you'll miss it's all few. You won't be able to progress any of the future things, and they're all like story locked in their local areas. And it's not that's one of the things that is not the most well done. And if you miss those, then you miss a lot of uh, Connor's actual character development and stuff like that. And it's sad. Wait, what? Drop. The side missions are where all of character, uh, all of Connor's oh. character development is, in three. And I if you miss one they're... of those, you miss all of them. Uh, and yeah. I don't seem to recall this. That's probably why I, or I should say, it's probably an indicator that I probably missed some. Yeah, a lot of the reason why people say that Connor is fuck is um, two-dimensional and a flat character and has no depth and all all of the, the all of the complaints that people have about uh, Connor as a character comes from the fact that they all skipped the side quests and went just through the main missions and then they didn't realize they were missing anything because they missed one and none of the others showed up. So, here's the thing, I never felt like his character was flat or boring. Rather just subdued. But I can't recall. It might be, it might be worth another playthrough for me. Damn it. Damn it, Ulta Eager! When I say go into the haystack, I mean go into the haystack. You know how these games work. Alright, I do have to actually adjust the volume on my side of things because going into the action set uh, see, sounds completely overwhelmed Discord. Okay. Um, I didn't but yeah, to, I... to listen to the balance with the, uh, the audio from the game. 
Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Vaughn, I will look into um into it with the the bot thing. Okay, I need uh okay. I can wait. I can do it later. Alright, let me just come here and do an eavesdrop thing, which is right there. Let me sit down here. Hey guys, don't worry about me. Did you see them? No. But I've heard the whispers. Is it true? Crusader knights in Jerusalem? It is. And? Different from the others. Finely dressed and bearing expensive gifts. <sighs> we should relieve them of this burden. They've made camp near David's citadel, close to the cemetery. To attend the funeral? So it seems. Then let us visit their camp while they pay their respects. Robert will be attending a funeral. All right, good to know. Okay. Um, well, I failed that one after succeeding it because I pushed the wrong button, and instead of gently passing through a crowd of people, I bumped into a crowd of people. So, you know, that's how that is. Um, eh, I'll go down here and do that, and then go back and try the other thing later. Um, I need to get more... Put the knife away out here. Um, sorry, guys. Pardon me. Coming through. Come here, let me touch your ass. There we go. Alright. Oop, oop. Don't mind me. Ah, oh, fuck it. Oh, lord. Well, guys, it's going well so far. <laughs> damn it! All I keep hearing is damn it and oh shit and uh man <laughs> and no 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 and and let me touch your butt. Oh man, I got caught. <laughs> yeah, I did uh, conveniently get caught as after I touched the guy's butt. So I guess you know just desserts and all that. That's what you get for sexual harassment. I mean. I technically asked permission, and then he proceeded to let me. He didn't punch me or anything, so I mean, it's the closest thing to actual consent in this game you'll get. Ah, but this is not consent. Yes, no, it's in. No, it is not consent. And technically, I'm not actually touching his butt. I'm just picking his back pocket. It's just that, with the animation of the thing, that is also illegal. I mean, I mean, you say this about the guy, about the character who is, you know, murdering people on a daily basis. You are so, such a terrible person. It's Altair's fault. Altair, my friend. Oh, Altair made you do it, or did you make Altair do it? Several archers posted in the region. Technically who was the neither. Real bad person. Technically neither. Al Walim was the bad person. This funeral has everyone on edge. The city guard has dispatched its best men to keep the peace. Because he's the one who orders Altair to do it, and thus I have to do it in order to complete the order so that Altair will, it can complete the order. I mean, realistically, Altair doesn't have to do any of the assassination. He just has to, like, you know... I mean, he could just decide to sit there for the entirety of everything, forever, until the end of time. Yeah, but that's not how history worked. It shouldn't be how the Animus works, but it is. You saw nothing. And failed. Because of course it was failed. Alright, let's try this again. Get out of the tree, all to ear. There we go. Honestly... I'm not spitting anything out. Stop. Thank you. 
Honestly, um, I feel like Assassin's Creed 1 should be a game that gets either remade or remastered using modern techniques. Because, I mean, imagine them using, like, the various different abilities that they have in, like, Odyssey, but with Assassin's Creed 1. No, I don't think I will. Honestly, I think that Assassin's Creed gameplay peaked in uh, Syndicate. I, I mean, it kind of did. Ah, oh, damn After it, that, I killed you, though. After that, switched to a, a, a different and, uh, I think, kind of overused style. It did. They were wanting to go... I don't understand their desire to try to make it a bit more RPG. I don't. I, I don't think I ever will. I, like, I mean, I kind of get... They, they want the microtransactions, man. Well, there's Ubisoft that. Yeah. Is turning into another EA. Well, yes, but there's also, but they had that with Unity and Sy a Syndicate as well, with their um, their Helix points or whatever the fuck. Yes, but in neither was it actually necessary to acquire the armor that you wanted, and, and they that's... didn't hide it behind, and they didn't uh, uh, artificially slow your uh, game progression. So as they to make didn't it in necessary. Odyssey or Origins either. I definitely felt like they did in Odyssey. I didn't get that feeling in Odyssey. I didn't get it in Origins. Um, I mean, they may have, I just didn't get the feeling of it, of it. Um, like, I, I can't, I honestly can't think of any time when they would, uh, how they could have done that. It's just that, yay, I actually succeeded. Okay, um, <clears throat> the, uh, the reason Odyssey was so slow in some regards was purely because that there was no passive way to gain resources as we've as we've talked about I before am forever grateful for your aid malik would never have forgiven me here's what i've learned for a man such as myself a direct assault in the cemetery would be impossible they're simply too where's many the guards. fun in that Instead, in regards to what science scholars who are sure to be in attendance it may not be the most direct um, approach but it's gonna get safer. some ice cream and maybe pass out we shall see I mean, if if you if you're tired, then you're tired. But ice cream sounds good. Sorry, was I too was I standing too close for your comfort in the middle of a crowded street? Jeez. Okay, maximum knives. All right, where am I going next? I'm going here for the interrogation. Alright. I mean, some, there are some people who would say that uh, game that Assassin's Creed gameplay peaked in... Oh, not killing people? Yeah, that... Where's the fun in not killing people? I fully agree. To quote science from other games, if it's red, it's dead. This way, we might forgive the sins of the past um, and bring about But yeah, there are some people tomorrow. who say that Assassin's Creed gameplay peaked in we must be uh, 4 we must slash be brave, Rogue. And, we must find the and that anything after that was just trying to and now instead, improve on what was already friends. essentially perfect. The Crusaders come to Jerusalem, bringing with them an opportunity to end the fighting, to stop the just war. Coins, that we may stand as one, we must not turn them away. Don't worry about me, guys. I'm just standing here praying while creepily staring at a guy under my hood. Don't worry about it. It's all good. Ooh, this looks like a good place. Uh... Nope, nope, nope. Oh, regret. Probably should have hit him before he came out of the alley. Shit. It's fine.
come on. Oh, oh, oh. but your words are hollow. No, I speak the truth. Why would you say other? You're a Templar. So I am. Then you are also a liar and a fraud, just like your master. Where is he? What does he intend? It's peace he seeks, I swear it. And the proof is in his actions. A Christian at a Muslim's funeral. We want an end to all of this. Only because it serves your needs. But this is a noble thing we want. Land will be united beneath our banner. United through force. You'd enslave us all. It is for the best. No, it's not. And so long as my brothers and I breathe, you will not succeed. <laughs> all right. And then next one rooftop race challenge. Okay. Sorry, lady, I don't have any. Where are you? Are you up there? Nope, there you are. Don't worry, I'm not here. Good to see you, brother. I trust you're here for the funeral. Or for Robert, rather. I've kept my eyes and ears open, but I've nothing to report. Things are quiet here. Perhaps Tariq has seen or heard something you can use. Tariq? He's stationed not far from here. Go to him. See what knowledge he has. Could you spare a few coins? This way. No, you don't understand. I have no idea. Lord, 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 hiring him. Come on, Altier, go up. There you go. Drop all the air. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Go quickly, go quickly, go quickly. No, please don't leave. Where is he going? Just a few points. Excellent timing, Altair. I found something you'll find quite useful. Orders for Avers guards. This map I've made will show you where he intends to station them. Put it to good use. Right. Um, that's the one I screwed up, so let's go ahead and do this one real quick. Okay. Oh, this is the one that's inside the fortress. Uh, okay. Alright, 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 alright. Come here. Don't worry, lady. Sorry, I'm just as poor and sick and hungry as you are. Actually, I'm probably not. I don't know. Altier doesn't seem to be rich, but he also doesn't seem to be poor. Mind us, just a group of um, of uh, very identically dressed scholars, and um, do not mind the one that's heavily armed in the middle. He's um, he's the most devout. That's why he's heavily armed. You do not wish me any harm. I know. Just be more 
too close to pickpocket. Okay. Take the map I've given you and see that the guards are placed accordingly. We'll be safe enough during the procession. It's the burial that worries me. Easy for our enemies to hide amongst the crowd. If you're so concerned, why not post your own men? Search the site yourselves. Our presence here has caused enough chaos. I can only imagine how the people would react, seeing Crusader soldiers marching across their holy ground. Then perhaps you should not attend at all. He was our friend and brother, and we will honor him as he passes from this world. You insult me by suggesting otherwise. I'll post the men. I don't want trouble either. Then stop trying to make it, and do as you've been asked. Okay, don't mind me, don't mind me. Just car carry on. Carry on about your business, man. It's all good. It's all good. Nope, nope, nope. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Nope, nope, not while you're standing there. Don't worry about me. I'm just, um, heavily armed guy praying. Don't worry about it. Well, your audio didn't activate, so. Ah, fuck. Okay. I need to come. I need to get out another way. Come on, up, 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 up. Alt here. Don't mind me, guys. Oh, shit. Uh. Yeet! Lady, I just fell out of the sky. Get out of my way. Just, uh, sitting here? Okay. Sorry, man, I forgot I had to have you targeted. You're fine, you're fine. I haven't gotten your thing yet. Carry on. Come here. Come here. There we go. Ah, fuck. Get the hell out of my way, guys. Alt here. Come on, come on, come on. Quickly, quick. Alt here. For real. How did you see that? Okay. You know what? Yes, let's run in the middle of the massive sword fight that's going on currently. That's very smart. Oh, come on. I'll see here. This is going well, guys. It's going very well. Alright. There we go. Finally. 
Good lord. Before you inevitably cause trouble. Alright. Am I on? Okay, I'm still good on that. <sighs> now let's try this again. Okay. Am I clear? Yes. There we go. Next is over here. Hi. Bye. Then. <sighs> Fuck it. All I did was get pushed by a guy. What the hell, guys? Really? Come on, Altier. We currently have uh, five viewers. Uh, who else here? Um, Yvonne, I think, went to lay down. I'm not sure if she's still here. Um, I think Howie's still here. Um, Science, I believe you might still be here. But who else is here? Huh. That was unintentional. Landed me right back where I uh, was intending to go. Okay, let's try this again. Why the hell did you guys just start screaming? Get off. There we go. In this way. Shank. This way. Up here. Give you a. Ah, oh, fuck! I didn't realize guards were right there. God damn it! Well, here we go again, guys. <laughs> I'm not certain. Well, welcome to those who are here. Um, I know the science. The last one you said the the strategy, whatever the <laughs> STRG, whatever that one's Howie. I don't know about the other two, unless one of those is Yvonne, um, and just misspelled. But well, welcome. Welcome, everybody. Alright. And once again, I ended up here. Convenient. Alright. You know what? You know what? Other direction. Let's try the other direction. Lady, move. I'm going the long way around because it's hopefully easier. Move, 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 move. Come on. All right, come here, come here, 
And of course there's a guard. Wait for the guard to pass. And Oh god. It's fine. It's fine guys. You didn't see anything. I did nothing. Oh. Uh, mm, don't mind me. I'm just a praying devout person. And you're dead. And next. I'd bypass him. Uh, guards, guards, guards. Shank. Oh, you weren't. You weren't my target. Come on. There we go. Leave me alone, God. Yay! Completed! Now I just need to get back without being noticed. I know now why I joined our clan. Just to be in your presence is a gift from God. This is what I have learned about Robert's men. They are well Welcome for uh, to Commander Root to and uh, Sadist Kitty. Better Welcome. to let them chase you for a while before striking back. But it is disrespectful for me to... And today, to filling in the role for a Twitch bot is Forgive my me, friend Master. Science. Lol. Okay. Alright, so that's all done. Okay, actually, before we before we go back to the thing and start the thing, let's go through the, what we've learned. And all right, uh, <laughs> all right. So starting with the first one, um, Robert and his men walk the streets of Jerusalem, finely dressed, bearing expensive gifts. They plan to attend a funeral where it, oh, were it anyone other than the monster Majdadin being buried, uh, buried, helps if I if I use the right English word or pronunciation of or whatever. Anyway, uh, Majdadin being buried, I might have second thoughts. But as it is, it seems a most fitting time to take the Templar's life. Fair, considering I was the one who killed Majdadin. Um, Robert's men are working with the Jerusalem Guard to protect the cemetery during Majdadin's funeral. Excuse me. Uh, doubling the guard would have posed a problem, but this map will give me an advantage knowing where the uh, men are stationed I can simply make sure I avoid them and we have a map let me take a quick snapshot of that Oop, I did not mean to do that come on okay uh, This was... Okay, this is the one I was just looking at. Here we go. Uh, they say Robert wants peace and seeks to prove it by attending a Muslim funeral. But I know the truth. He does not seek peace, but control dominion over the land and its people. I will deny him this. Fair. Templars and all that. Um... Uh, Robert's men are well prepared for battle. To fight them all at once would be unwise. Usually the case. Should I lose control of the situation, it's best I make a brief escape and return later to eliminate them one by one. Okay. Another map with another set of people. Alright. And I did it. I did it again, guys. I pushed the wrong button. Uh, reaching Robert might prove difficult, given the number of guards around. Were I to join a group of scholars... I could make my way to him much more easily. Okay, and so there's a scholar group nearby that could make it through uh, some of the guards, which I've done a couple of times by now. Uh, next. The Jerusalem guard have set up the, stand, the standing pa uh, po bleh, the standing positions, there we go, for the Christians during the procession to to better protect them in the case the in case the citizens take offense to their presence. Uh, this map displays exactly where everyone is standing, even Robert, especially Robert. And then yet another map. All right. 
Now, oops, wrong button. There we go. All right. So looking at the maps uh, that I got the that I just took pics of, the funeral is most likely down here. In fact, it is down there. Yes. Um, okay, I'm as zoomed in as I can be. Let's clear the. Can I clear? There we go. Okay. Um, <clears throat> there will be someone here, guard here. Um, right around there is where the main thing is, but guards all throughout these rooftops through here. Yep. Okay. And then the group of scholars that I'll be looking for is right here. I believe. Let me let me confirm with the map. That's there. Here. Guards here. Yeah, right here. Um Robert's men will be right here, 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 oh, no, here, here, and here. Uh, again, over here. Okay. Robert should be stationed right here. Should be. Okay. But yeah, I will mark where the scholars are and keep that in mind. All right, back to the bureau. A few coins. All I ask is for Make sure I'm stacked, stocked up on everything. I am. Is he running from somewhere? Where is he going? Where is he running? Y'all ready for this? Time to get Robert de Saab, the master of the Knights Templar, the big bad guy. the scent of success about you, brother. I've learned much about our enemy. Share your knowledge, then. Let us see what can be done with it. Robert and his Templars walk the city. They've come to pay their respects to Mejdur Dean. They'll attend his funeral, which means so will I. What is this that Templars would attend his funeral? I have yet to divine their true intentions, though I'll have a confession in time. The citizens themselves are divided. Many call for their lives. Still others insist that they are here to parley, to make peace. Peace? I told you. The others I've slain have said as much to me. That would make them our allies. And yet we killed them. Make no mistake. We are nothing like these men. Though their goal sounds noble, the means by which they'd achieve it are not. At least, that's what Al Mualim told me. So what is your plan? I'll attend the funeral and confront Robert. The sooner the better. Fortune favor your blade, brother. Malik, before I go, there's something I should say. Be out with it. I've been a fool. Normally, I'd make no argument, but what is this? <laughs> what are you talking about? All this time, I never told you I was sorry. Too damn proud. You lost your arm because of me. Lost Qadr. You had every right to be angry. I do not accept your apology. I understand. No. You don't. I do not accept your apology because you are not the same man who went with me into Solomon's temple. And so you have nothing to apologize for. Malik. Perhaps if I had not been so envious of you, I would not have been so careless myself. I'm just as much to blame. Don't say such things. We are one. As we share the glory of our victories, so too should we share the pain of our defeat. In this way, we grow closer. We grow stronger. Thank you, brother. Rest if you need to, Altair, that you might be ready for what lies ahead. Aw, friendship! Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. Robert is, atten is attending Majdadin's funeral. This is when to strike. Let's see if they added any more information to the memory log. 
Robert de Sable and his men are in Jerusalem to attend Majdadin's funeral. And he says it is to promote peace between the Christians and the Muslims, but he has something else in mind. I shall strike him down during the procession and find out what he truly intends. <clears throat> All right. Allons-y. Time to do this. Save the world, everybody! Oh, there we go. Sorry, birds. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, well, that wasn't as bad as it could have been. Uh, I'm not going that way. Oh, okay, well, apparently I'm on the ground now. That's okay. No, you don't understand. I Stay out of my way. You'll hurt someone at that speed. I beg of you. I beg of you. Just a minute. Am I even going the right direction? Okay, I am. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> okay. Here is the. Hold on, lady. Me. Okay. So here's the initial guard's position. There are the patrols. I'm gonna just slip on by through here. Could go over the roofs, however. I know that there are guards on the roofs. Uh, probably my best route is through the scholars, as I said already. Um... Those are over here. Are they? Scholars? Apparently there's not scholars here. Or am I not far enough? Where was that? There is. Ouch. What? Is that there? Oh. What? How does that match up to that? Oh, unless it's... No, it's not down there. Yeah, there should be scholars, like, right here. Huh. Scholars! Huh. Well, we just go up on the roof. Maybe they didn't spawn, or got chased away for some reason? Don't, don't know. They're not a marked group of scholars, which means that they're probably just individual roamers. Which means that they might, I might have to wait for their patrol route to finish, wherever that is. However... <sighs> don't, don't, don't worry about me, man. Fine, I'll go, I'll, I'll go down. I'll go down. I'm sorry. Don't worry about me. I'm down. See, I'm down. Okay. Hmm. Have you moved on? Can I go back up? Yes. Okay. For now.
Maybe, they, maybe they're further over. Hold on. Are they over here? No. That's not necessarily a good thing. Okay. Well, I w guess I'll just have to. Uh, well, I don't want to start combat with those guys, so let me drop off the roofs. And then come over here. No, you don't understand. Lady, I'm sorry. Get out of my way. Still no scholars over there. Let's see what's over here. Oh, hi guys. Don't mind me. And there's more guards. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna Spider-Man my way up the wall real quick. Oh, am I being watched? Ah, I am. By two people. That's... I'm dropping. I'm dropping. I'm sorry. Ah, damn it. It's fine, guys. It's fine. I'm not... I dropped. It's, it's fine, guys. Uh... Okay. Um... Wow, the scholars not being on them where they should be is really fucking with me. I, the thing is, I don't even remember if they're actually supposed to be there or not, or if it's just that they didn't spawn or... Oh, don't mind me, guys. Maybe... I completed all the civilian things. They really should be right there. That's so... Unless... Unless they're not... Unless it's a lie. Unless all the maps are a lie. Oh, shit. Hi, man. Sorry, I'm not... Nope. I regret my decisions. Alright, coming through. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Are you watching? Am I clear? I'm clear. Well, I'm now on the inside of the guards. So let's drop down a bit. Okay. And survey the area. In fact, none of these positions of the guard, uh, very few of the positions of the guards and things actually match the maps that I got. So they might be misinformation. Well, I'm in. That's what matters. Um. Wow, that guy's... There we go. ...mourn the loss of our beloved Majdiddin. Taken too soon from Robert. this world. I know you feel sorrow and pain at his passing. But you should not. For just as we are all brought forth from the womb, so too must we all one day pass from this world. It is only natural, like the rising and the setting of the sun. Take this moment to reflect on his life and give thanks for all the good he did. Know that one day you will stand with him again in paradise. As you know, this man was murdered. We have tried Oof. to track his killer, but it has proved difficult. These creatures cling to the shadows and run from any who would. This can't be good.
Oh, what's happening? And my game just crashed. Damn it! Uh, rip. <laughs> I will. I guess I'll be right back. Let me see if I can uh, if I can set things back. I'll I'll be right back. Sorry, guys. I'm back again sorry about that everybody I I don't know why game just randomly crashed it's like it's old or something <laughs> all right well I have to talk uh, I have to talk to uh, Malik again so you bear with me success about you, while we go through this again I've learned much about our enemy share your knowledge then let us see what can be done with it. let's see if the uh, They've come to pay the respect Scholars to Scholars uh, spawned attend again, his funeral, which or actually so spawned What is this time? that Templars would attend his funeral? I have yet to divine their true intentions, though I'll have a confession in time. The citizens themselves are divided. Many call for their lives. Still others insist that they are here to parlay, to make peace. Peace? I told you. The others I've slain have said as much to me. That would make them our allies. Hydration reminder, and yet we by the way, them. for everybody There's watching. No we are nothing like these men. Though Stay hydrated. Though sounds noble, the means by which they'd achieve it are not. At least, that's what Al Mualim told me. So what is your plan? I'll attend the funeral and confront Robert. The sooner the better. Fortune favor your blade, brother. Malik, before I go, there's something I should say. Be out with it. I've been a fool. Normally I'd make no argument, but what is this? What are you talking about? All this time, I never told you I was sorry. Too damn proud. You lost your arm because of me. Lost Qadr. You had every right to be angry. I do not accept your apology. I understand. No, you don't. I do not accept your apology because you are not the same man who went with me into Solomon's temple. And so you have nothing to apologize for. Malik. Perhaps if I had not been so envious of you, I would not have been so careless myself. I'm just as much to blame. Don't say such things. We are one. As we share the glory of our victories, so too should we share the pain of our defeat. In this way, we grow closer. We grow stronger. Thank you, brother. Rest if you need to, Altair. Thanks, Let's science. Be ready for what lies ahead. Uh, so how's everybody's day going? Um, it's a holiday. Y'all having, um, for those of you who have off work, are you having a good day? Alright, so let's try this again. Alright, so there is no scholars marked here, which is fine. Um, however, okay, yeah, no, there's no actual scholar mark, 
uh, which means, which is fine, because that means I didn't have a civilian mission there, which is fine, because, you know, no civilian mission needed. Um, but we'll try there, because I have a map that says there should be some scholars there. But, uh, you know what, I'm just going to take the, eleva uh, the, the elevator down. Oh yeah, I hope the I don't I hope you guys don't lose power either. Um, it's rough. Yeah, um, <clears throat> Teddy mentioned y'all were having uh, we're having massive thunderstorms in the. Uh, wrong way, this way. Pardon me, guys. Come through. Is it like remnants of like a tropical storm or anything like that, or or do you do you know what's co if there's any have has the weather channel said anything about what could be the cause or any or anything like that, or is it just like the normal type of storms for the time period? I'll tear. Oh, I'll tear. For real, man. Doesn't usually have the spiral shape that we usually get. Oh. As big storm rains out over land. Yeah. So I guess it's just a freak storm then. Back at the graveyard, where we were. Lady, sorry, get out of my way. Oh, don't, don't mind me, guys. Ah, fuck. God damn it. I tried. No scholars still. So. Yeah, that means I'm gonna have to try, I'm just gonna have to do what I did last time. I go in through the roofs. I'll tear. Correctly, I had to go up. Was it uh, I think it was here I had to go up. Oh, hey man, don't mind me. Just uh, don't look down. Okay, are you just gonna pivot on the spot? Okay, there you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. Don't mind me. Just gonna come over here. You need to control. How can you see me? Don't mind me. I'm not here. I was literally on the other side of a building, but okay. Okay, you're pivoting. Alt ear. Alt ear. I s get out. There you go. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. Don't worry. Okay. I'm back. Oh, welcome back, Howie. I'm sorry. I had a minor freezer emergency, and then I, uh... And then I ate lunch. 
Fair, fair. Eating lunch is important. My game crashed. Yvonne is alive and back, probably. Welcome back, Yvonne. But yeah, well, you two were gone. Um, my uh, my game crashed for unknown reasons, and I have to restart this. For just as we are all brought forth from the womb, so too must we all one day pass from this world. It is only natural. It's yeah, it's like it's an old game or something. Take this moment. To reflect but it's a remaster. His life and this his one life isn't actually. For all the good yeah, they should remaster. They, no. they no. haven't remastered no. Assassin's Creed One no. at all. No. They haven't done anything no. with it since the original. I'm, I was pretty sure they did. I'm pretty sure they didn't. What they did was they re-released the original on UPlay <laughs> with upgraded it, uh, textures. Nope. Right? No. 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 Just the original. They made it so that it was so that you could save your game um, through UPlay, rather than keep it on your local hard drive. Weird. That's literally the only thing they did to it. As you know, this man was murdered. We have tried to track his killer. Yep. Okay. But it has proved well, difficult. These creatures. It's right around here where the game crashed. So. Face them fairly, but not today. For seems one stands among us. He must be unable to actually finish the game. To <laughs> I know. Seize him. Bring him forward. That God's justice might Rip. be done. Called out. Okay. I'll see her. Come on, man. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, you know what? I'm actually gonna do what the, uh, the text thing said to do, and that was run the fuck away and try again in a minute. I'll tear. Come on. I'm up the ladder, I'll tear. Okay, fine, don't go up the ladder. Up, up, there you go. Come on, here, come on. Need to break that line of sight. There's nobody here behind me. For real, though. Real though, I full on lost them. Oh, well, sit down or something. It's like I have to kill this guy or something. It's fine. It's fine. And okay. Assassin's well. Creed game? What's the point? Yeah. All right. All right. All right. There's always a big. All right. We'll do it the right way. Let's go. And by the right way, I mean getting my face pummeled in. Come on, guys. No, no grabby. No touchy. Okay, you know what? I'm apparently failing at the counter. At the counter, so. And I am way too low of health to be worrying about it. Oof. Okay. No, no, no touchy. What do you know? Yikes. Maybe still bad at this game. And I dead. <sighs> okay. <laughs> yes, Jamie's still bad at this game. Oh! So... I'm still forever so rusty. Okay, well... Not, not touchy, guys. Alright. Ow, fucking okay, that's right. There, that's right. The thing that makes this fight so much fun are the endless bur uh, um, barrage of archers. 
Okay. Alright. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Excuse me while I take care of one of these archers. Over here. Let me target. Yep. Nope, no targeting that archer? Okay. What about if I come over here? Not you. Still not you. Get, get off the platform, Altair. Okay, that's one way of getting off the platform. Alright. Are all the archers dead, I believe? Yes. Okay. Let's go. Alright. No, no, that's it. Tachi, I said. There we go. I would see your eyes before you die. <laughs> now I know what it's like to have someone else touch my butt. Yeah, a little bit, yeah, and a few other places, yes. What sorcery is this? No sorcery. We knew you'd come. Robert needed to be sure he'd have time to get away. So he flees. We cannot deny your success. You have laid waste to our plans. First the treasure, then our men. Control of the Holy Land slipped away. But then he saw an opportunity. To reclaim what has been stolen. To turn your victory to our advantage. Al Muallim still holds your treasure, and we've routed <clears throat> your army before. Whatever Robert plans, he'll fail again. I don't think I really have much to contribute. Ah, I can't really listen while I'm on the now. Discord, because otherwise I'd be... I mean, you could you could mute me on Discord and just respond in the to that to the end game. They have no reason to. It just be a little late. Very, very, uh, very laggy. Very uh, inorganic conversations. Fair. And at that point, I may as well just respond via text. Yeah. See, Yvonne's got me. Not nine, eight. What do you mean? You are not my target. I will not take your life. You're free to go. Anyway, I'm gonna dip but out. Do not follow me. Okay, see stream, you, man. Dude. You're already too late. Thanks, man. See ya. We'll see. See ya. All right. So, not killing Robert de Salve's, uh doppelganger, because you know, not my target. So, not gonna die. And suddenly, I'm no longer hunted or anything. Lol. <clears throat> it's like I killed everybody who saw me, or something like that. Over here. Okay, let me, let me just do that. Okay. I am so tired of all these archers. Okay. Oh, 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 up. There you go, I'll... Nope. No, don't, don't, don't kill him. Don't kill him. Killing him is not a good idea. Trust me. Oh, okay, well. I'll tear. I'll tear. Come on. There you go. Oh, fuck. Get up, I'll tear. I'll tear. I'll tear. We talked about this, man. Come on. There you go. All right. Oh, fuck. Alright, up I go.
Okay. I'm still 105 whatever meters or whatever the fuck away from the bureau. Which isn't that bad, actually. Turned to chaos. What happened? Robert de Sable was never here. He sent another in his stead. He was expecting me. You must go to Al Mualim. There's no time. She told me where he's gone, what he plans. If I return to Masyaf, he might succeed. And then, I fear we'll be destroyed. We have killed most of his men. He cannot hope to mount a proper attack. Wait, did you say she? Yes, it was a woman. Strange, I know. But that's for another time. For now, we must focus on Robert. We may have thinned his ranks, but the man is clever. He goes to plead his case to Richard and Salah Adin, to unite them against the common enemy, against us. Surely you're mistaken. This makes no sense. These two men would never. Oh, but they would. And we have ourselves to blame. The men I've killed, men on both sides of the conflict, men important to both leaders. Robert's plan may be ambitious, but it makes sense. And it could work. Look, brother. Things could have work. changed. You must return to Masyaf. We cannot act without our master's permission. It could compromise the Brotherhood. I thought... I thought you had learned this. Stop hiding behind words, Malik. You wield the creed and its tenants like some shield. He's keeping things from us. Important things. You were the one told me we could never know anything, only suspect. Well, I suspect this business with the Templars goes deeper. When I'm done with Robert, I will write for Masyaf that we may have answers. But perhaps you could go now. I cannot leave the city. Then walk amongst its people. Seek out those who serve the ones I slew. Learn what you can. You call yourself perceptive. Perhaps you'll see something I could not. I don't know. I must think on this. Do as you must, my friend. But it's time I ride for Arsuf. Every moment I delay, Oof. our enemy gets one step ahead of me. Be careful, brother. I will be. I promise. All right. Robert was never at the funeral. Ride to Arsuf and find Robert. All right. Now for me to yeet myself out of the city. Get, get, get down, Altair. Come on. Sorry, guys. Coming through. There we go. You know, I have a motif I have to go for. Alright. And now, 
As you can see, I've opened the entire map. I've gotten every Templar and all the viewpoints, as I've said. Now we go to Arsuf, a place we've never been before, and can only access now. Don't worry about it, guys. Actually, let me look at the map. Okay, if I go straight, that'll take me the fastest route. Or the most direct, at the very least, not necessarily the fastest. Yeah, I'm galloping by on a horse. You're not gonna catch me, guys. Neither are y'all. Or y'all. So, just, just kind of give up now. Right now, if I go... Yeah, I... Come on, I'll, I'll tear, come on. Up, 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 up. And this way... There's some of Richard's men. Sorry, guys. In a hurry. Oh, oh, I'm on a tree now. Okay, where do I go? Okay, I need to go north first. Oh, come on, Altair. Oh, bypass these guys so they don't knock me down. Eh, nope. Not gonna run through you guys either. Now, if I remember correctly, it's just... Oh, almost there. Still not there yet. Um, right here. Oh, here go. the right way? I am not. Because that was my turn. Come on, Altier. And here we go. In the Aratuf. Ladders are a socially acceptable way to reach a roof. Alright, alright, alright. Um I'm gonna get on the horse and go through this. Actually, that's a lot of soldiers. like this is a war zone. Oh, there's some of the uh, Salah Adin's men. Salah Adin, I think, is actually pronounced. Longbowmen, dead bodies. <clears throat> Come on, guys. There you go, Altair. And throw him off the edge. And I'm not gonna worry about you too. Sort of way out here. Your life. 
Nope, no touching. Come on. No, I said no. You fell. Did you mean to do that? Over here, you're mine. Come on. Okay, fine. Up the, up the ladder, Altair. Good lord. Okay, well. Here we go. Next. Oh, that's a lot of guys. Come on. Ah, I'm so. S Come on. There we go. We're almost there, I believe. Yep, here we go. Oh, nope, it lied to me. Come on. No? Nobody? Okay, fine. See the massive message, Yvonne. I'll read it in a second. Okay, so before I progress there, let me read what Yvonne said. <clears throat> uh, actually, here, let me let me do it on my phone because that way I don't have to worry about having to alt tap to 
scroll up. Alright. Come on. Connecting. And of course it doesn't track that. Okay, fine. Fine. Uh. Give me just a second. It's all good. It's all good, Yvonne. It's my fault for not having more of the of the Twitch chat showing. Uh, so your friend Eladora, for those uh, for those who know Eladora, okay, uh, ordered this thing from Etsy, which looks super cool, but it broke, and apparently the seller's customer service was real crappy and couldn't get it replaced, repaired, or let her repair it herself. Interesting. So you're staring at the online listing, trying to figure out how to remake it. Uh, and you're saying all of it because it's a hood with a stretchy mask attached, and it gives you strong Assassin's Creed vibes. <laughs> yeah. Um, definitely, uh, I mean, most hoods, you know. Uh, I bet it does. Um, it, depending on how the mask looks and everything. Altira, there you go. I found some soldiers. Hi guys, don't mind me. Okay, here we go. Yeah, the um, the hood mask combination does sound badass, and I am here for it. Excuse me while I carve a bloody swath through the Crusader armies, as well as the, uh, both sides of this war. I'll tear. I swear to God. Oh. Cam camera? There we go. I camera just glitched into a rock. That's always fun. It even has similar construction of the Assassin's Creed hood. Does it have the uh, little beak thing on the tip? The point? The, the it has a slight beak but not a full point so probably less the Levantine order of Assassin's Creed 1 and probably a bit more of the more subtle beaks of later games of like maybe 2 or well 3 had a pretty pro profound peak to it um, 4 didn't have a peak at all uh, neither did any of the later games because they were blending in a bit more, but two had a pretty subtle peak, if I remember correctly. Here we go. Come no further. Hold a moment. It's words I bring, not steel. Offering terms of surrender, then. It's Ooh. about time. Hello there, King Richard. You misunderstand. It's Al Muallam who sends me, not Salah Hadin. Assassin. What is the meaning of this? And be quick with it! You've a traitor in your midst. Oops, he has button. hired you to kill me? Come to gloat about it before you strike? I wouldn't be taken so easily! It's not you I've come to kill. It's him. Speak then! That I may judge the truth! Who is this traitor? Robert de Sable. My lieutenant! <laughs> he aims to betray. That's not the way he tells it. He seeks revenge against your people for the havoc you've wrought in Arkham. And I am inclined to support him. Some of my best men were murdered by some of yours. It was I who killed them, and for good reason. Hear me out. William of Montferrat. He sought to use his soldiers to take Akka by force. Gagné de Naplouse. He would use his skills to indoctrinate and control any who resisted. Sabran. He intended to block the ports, preventing your kingdom from providing aid. They betrayed you, and they took their orders from Robert. 
You expect me to believe this outlandish tale? You knew these men better than I. Are you truly surprised to learn of their ill intentions? Is this true? There he is. My liege. Robert de Sable. The assassin that stands before us. These creatures are masters of manipulation. Of course it isn't true. I've no reason to deceive. Oh, but you do. You're afraid of what will happen to your little fortress. Can it withstand the combined might of the Saracen and the Crusader army? My concern is for the people of the Holy Land. If I must sacrifice myself for there to be peace, so be it. This is a strange place we find ourselves in. Each of you accusing the other. There really is no time for this. I must be off to meet with Saladin and enlist his aid. The longer we delay, the harder this will become. Hold a moment, Robert. Why? What do you intend? Surely you do not believe him? It is a difficult decision, one I cannot make alone. I must leave it in the hands of one wiser than I. Thank you. No, Robert, not you. <laughs> then who? The Lord. Let this be decided by <laughs> combat. Surely Get shot on, Robert. With the one whose cause is righteous. If this is what you wish, it is. So be it. All right, let's see if I can end this in one hit. Well, okay. Not initially one hit, but when I get to Robert. <laughs> Come on, Altair, get up. You know what? Okay. Nope, no gravity. Too soon, too soon, come on. Still too soon. Come on, Altier, come on, come on, come on. I hate the slow swings. I hate them so much. There we go. Nope, nope, nope. Come on. Come on, guys, come on. No, no, okay, fine. Damn it! Come on! And there's death. Fuck, I should not have switched to the hidden blade. I'm just not getting that timing right today. <sighs> okay. Alright. Swap, swap weapons. Come on. Okay, fine. There we go. Stop. Come on, Altair, get up. Altair, come on.
I've never had this much difficulty with these fights in the past. Uh, okay. I think I'm just being impatient. Nope, no grabby. Okay. I got it. I got it. No touchy. That's fair. Yep. Come on. And here we go. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Get the timing right, Alt here. It's done, then. Your schemes, like you, are put to rest. <laughs> you know nothing of schemes. You're but a puppet. He betrayed you, boy, just as he betrayed me. Speak sense, Templar, or not at all. Nine men he sent you to kill, yes? The nine who guarded the treasure's secret. What of it? It wasn't nine who found the treasure, assassin. Not nine, but ten. A tenth? None may live who carry the secret. Give me his name. Oh, but you know him well. And I doubt very much you'd take his life as willingly as you've taken mine. Who? It is your master, Al Mualim. But he is not a Templar. Did you never wonder how it is he knew so much? Where to find us? How many we numbered? What we aspire to attain? He is the master of the assassins. We, oui. master of lies. You and I just two more pawns in his grand game. And now, with my death, only you remain. Do you think he'll let you live, knowing what you do? I've no interest in the treasure. Ah, but he does. The only difference between your master and I is that he did not want to share. No. Ironic, isn't it? That I, your greatest enemy, kept you safe from harm. But now you've taken my life, and in the process, and did your own. Well fought, assassin. It seems God favors your cause this day. God had nothing to do with it. I was God had. Ah, you may not believe in him, but it seems he believes in you. Hold on. Can I adjust the music volume? What the hell? Okay, music volume is a bit loud, so let's bump that down a bit. Draining, and you know it's loud when it's draining out the voices in the game. Before you go, I have a question. Ask it then. Why? Why travel all this way? Risk your life a thousand times, all to kill a single man. He threatened my brothers and what we stand for. Ah, vengeance then. No. Not vengeance, justice, that there might be peace. This is what you fight for? Peace? Do you see the contradiction? Some men cannot be reasoned. Like that madman, Saladin. 
I think he'd like to see an end to this war as much as you. So I've heard, but never seen. Even if he doesn't say it, it's what the people want. Saracen and Crusader alike. The people know not what they want. It's why they turn to men like us. Then it falls to men like you to do what is right. <laughs> Nonsense. We come into the world kicking and screaming. Violent and unstable. It is what we are. We cannot help ourselves. No. We are what we choose to be. <laughs> Your kind. Always playing with words. I speak the truth. There's no trick to be found here. We'll know soon enough. But I fear you cannot have what you desire this day. Even now, that heathen Saladin cuts through my men and I must attend to them. But perhaps, having seen how vulnerable he is, he will reconsider his actions. Yes, in time what you seek may be possible. You were no more secure than him. Do not forget that. The men you left behind to rule in your stead did not intend to serve you for longer than they had yes. to. Yes. <laughs> I am There's my horse peeking over the edge up there. Then I'll take my leave. <laughs> my master and I have much to discuss. It seems that even he is not without fault. He is only human, as are we all. You as well. Safety and peace be upon you. Peeking up over that ridge like, hi, are you done? Are we ready to go? <laughs> Can we go home now? It looks violent down there. <laughs> Why are you covered in blood? Up, God damn it. Listen. Oh no. Seems your assassin friends found us. What? How'd you do it, Desmond? Hey, hey, look, I don't know what you're talking about, but whatever's going on down there has got nothing to do with me. They're here for you, and I sure as shit didn't invite them. What's the situation down there? We're taking heavy fire. Can you contain it, or do I need to evacuate the prisoner? The culmination of the emails we read. We've got them outnumbered. Couple of wounded, but we'll pull through. We'll get it under control. God damn you, Desmond. You couldn't leave well enough alone. I told you I had nothing to do with this. How would I even contact them? Telepathy? Come on. Doesn't matter. They'll be dead soon enough. Here, have a listen. Threat's been neutralized. Looks like the cavalry won't be coming. Dunno, Doc. We're freaking out a minute ago. Your little research facility not as secure as you thought it was? Worried they'll be back with more? I don't think so, Desmond. What Lucy here is trying to say is that there aren't any assassins left to come for you. We've been very busy this past year, hunting down your little enclaves, your desert communes and whatnot. I'm afraid you're on your own. Rest up, Mr. Miles. Tomorrow, we finish this. Bring your ass here. Let me kick your ass. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Ah, fine. Get get off the wall, Desmond. Come on. <sighs> Those secret messages in the emails just got the assassins killed. I'm sorry, but Desmond. You between them and Desmond. Lucy. Do you think? They sent a team there, but the place was deserted. I don't know where your parents are, and I can't promise they're still alive. But I think they got away. Thanks. Thanks for checking. It's not as bad as it seems. What are you talking about? They just killed, literally killed, my only chance of getting out of here. And then I find out the assassins are all but destroyed, and, and Christ, I still don't know what these people are planning. But I do know they plan to kill me when they're done. I am screwed. Okay? What do you want me to do? Just try and have a little faith. Your... Have faith. Rest up, Desmond. You're gonna need the energy. Can I talk to you some more? Aren't you tired? Nope. Okay. 
Hey, yep. So for anyone not aware, uh, because they don't point it out in this game, it gets pointed out in a few in future games. Uh, the hidden the assassins uh, up to a certain time had to get had to sacrifice the uh, ring finger on their left hand in order to wield the hidden blade. Um, because the design of it, that finger got in the way. And so they kind of made it this whole ritualistic, uh, meaningful, you sacrifice a, an, a, a finger in order to gain something much more powerful type of a thing. Um, and as such, it became this kind of a symbol within the world of the Assassin's Order. And even after they no longer after the they modified the modified the hidden blade so that it didn't have to actually sacrifice that finger they still marked that finger in one way or another to deter, to signify their thing i would have gone back out but there were no more emails and we can check them later get up even earlier than usual doc I'd like to get this over with as quickly as possible. If you say so. Don't be so glum, Mr. Miles. Today is a historic day. One that will be remembered for years to come. Remembered by some of us, anyway. Yeah, if he didn't if he wasn't planning on killing me before, he's definitely planning on killing Desmond now. <laughs> Can I talk to Lucy? No? Okay. Can I talk to you? Can I talk to you now? Now that you've talked- No? Okay. Can I punch you? I really want to punch you. Vidic, the most- one of the most punchable men in the Assassin's Creed games. <laughs> Alright. Well. Here we go. Complete, 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 and that just leaves this one. Ready to get to work, Desmond? Let's do this. When you are exposed, use sharp turns. Or climb over buildings to break. What happened here? Where is everyone? Gone to see the master. Was it the Templars? Did they attack again? They walked the path. What path? What are you talking about? Towards the light. Speak sense. There is only what the master shows us. This is the truth. You've lost your mind. You too will walk the path, or you will perish. So the master commands. It was Al Mualim, wasn't it? What's he done to you? Praise be to the master, for he has led us to the light. Well, he's completely brain dead. Oh, hey, look, he's following me. Mualim, guide us, command us. Hmm. The guy was wearing assassin's robes. Hmm. He is the light. He is the way. They are now following me. I've got a posse. Hmm. Let's see how many of them I can get. <laughs> can I get everybody in the town following me? Oh, Mualim, guide us, command us. Oh, here's another one. Hey, man. You want to join in the conga line, too? The will of the master must be obeyed. All right, let's let let's let everybody catch up. All right, pardon me.
But yeah, just just to show you what I was talking about. The see, there's his left hand that him. has the uh, hidden blade on it. See, goes right through where that finger was. I appreciate you guys keeping a long further than six feet back. That that's uh, very socially conscious of you. Though the following is kind of creepy. <laughs> hey guys, you're following me. Make sure you like and subscribe. No, the okay, I'm sorry. I'm not, but I'm <laughs> okay. World will be cleansed, it will begin anew. That sounds... fun? I guess? Oh, there's a guy up here. Hello, senor. He is the light. He is the way. There's another person up there, but I'll get that way. And by going the other way... Uh, is there anybody up here? He does not appear to be. The world will be cleansed. We will begin anew. Worlds will be cleansed. We will begin anew. You know, why is it that all the power-hungry, crazed, fanatical uh, <laughs> was the gross in regards to the general concept of what's happening right here, or the the horrible joke I just made, or not just made, but did make? Well, the birds aren't following me. That's um that's a good thing. He is the light. Hello, he senor. Is the way. It was trash, the dreadful joke. Yeah, it was absolute trash, but I'm okay with that. Cuz you know, sometimes you have to make a trash joke. Let me come back around here. Make sure you guys he are still coming. Light. Oh, someone got way. stuck back there. A couple people got stuck back there. Are you coming? Okay, you're coming still. Are you? Yeah. Oh, what's a good, uh, what's a good, uh, royalty free following song? Leading song and following song. Hmm. Oh, Mualim, guide us, command us. We're going on a journey. Journey, a journey. Only speak, master, and show us the path. Yeah, this can't be. This is the ants go marching. Oh man, yeah, that one probably actually. To be fair, the will of the master must be obeyed. Where the hell did you come from? Hello. And up here. The will of the master must be obeyed. There is a point where combat will happen. I remember. So I don't want to. I don't want to go there. But I will swoop up these ones. Is there? Yeah, that's it. All right. The will of the master. Let's go back the other direction. Obeyed. The will of the master must be obeyed. Well. I got my myself a nice little uh, <laughs> a moment when Altair has more followers in game than I do. Oh, Mualim, guide us, command us. <laughs> Welcome to Crimson Knight Gaming, where I will absolutely make tor terrible, terrible jokes and talk through all the emotional and important bits of a video game. <laughs> Like, follow, and subscribe. Oh, hello, lady. I think you're a lady. Are you a lady? Yes, you're a lady. Not to assume your gender or anything. Only but, you know. speak, master, and show us the path. Oh, I hit a checkpoint. That's always a good sign. 
I think I have officially gathered everybody. I wish there was an achievement for that, but there's not. Uh, okay. Alright. Now this route was the other one I was coming up over here. The one that I turned back on because I didn't see any more guys. I mean, let these guys all catch up. Got some few stra stragglers back there. We're actually doing pretty good on time. It's only 4.37. Um, so we're only seven minutes over. Um, and while there's several stages to this, um, they're not long stages, if I remember correctly. So we shouldn't be, we shouldn't not actually make it to five, which is good. Hey guys, are you here to follow me or are you guys going to shank me? I feel like you guys are going to shank me. Yeah, especially because, um, new ones are actually armed and those guys are leaving. I lost my followers. Hey, look, they got tired of my jokes. Uh, I don't want to kill these guys. It's not their fault. Oop. It's really not their fault. I don't like that I'm having to do this. Unfortunately, they have not introduced knockout abilities yet. That's in uh, the next game, actually. Oof, I just got barreled down. Alright, come on, guys. I didn't have to kill all of them. Ah! I'm tired. Up here. Reinforcements have arrived. Yay! Oh. There we go. You picked a fine time to arrive. So it seems. Guard yourself well, friend. Al Mualim has betrayed us. Yes. Betrayed the Templar allies as well. How do you know? After we spoke, I returned to the ruins beneath Solomon's temple. Robert had kept a journal, filled its pages with revelations. What I read there broke my heart. But it also opened my eyes. You were right, Altair. All along, our master has used us. We were not meant to save the Holy Land, but deliver it to him. He must be stopped. Be careful, Malik. What he's done to the others, he'll do to us given the chance. You must stay far from him. What would you propose? My blade arm is still strong and my men remain my own. It would be a mistake not to use us. Distract these thralls then. Assault the fortress from behind. If you can draw their attention away from me, I might reach Al Muallam. I will do as you asked, Dai. The men we face, their minds are not their own. If you can avoid killing them. Yes. Though he has betrayed the tenets of the creed, it does not mean we must as well. I do right. what I can. It's all I ask. Safety and peace, my friend. Your presence here will deliver us both. Okay. Alright. There's where, at the beginning of the game, I re unleashed the logs that took out the Templars uh, attacking the fortress at the beginning of the game. And...
you ever had that trapped feeling? Like, maybe you walked into something you shouldn't have. training ring where I kicked the ass of many a recruit and a bunch of civilians or at least some civilians and others nobody up here Let's see will you guys let me pass or will I have to fight you guys there are so many innocents I must be careful not to harm them okay you guys are letting me pass Coming through, guys. Coming through. Pardon me. Coming through. Is he up here, I wonder? In the study? I mean, the minimap marker says the other direction, but no. Is there anything up here? At all? Nope. Okay. Well. Y'all ready for the final boss fight? Let's do this. Hey look, that trapped feeling is back. No! What's happening? So, a student returns. I've never been one to run. Um. Never been one to listen, either. I still live because of it. What will I do with you? Let me go. Oh, Altair. I hear the hatred in your voice. Feel its heat. Let you go? Well, that would be unwise. Why are you doing this? I found proof. Proof of what? That nothing is true. And everything is permitted. Come. Destroy the betrayer. Send him from this world. Oh. Hello, everybody that I just killed. I go Sabrand. No, no. Garnier. Uh, I want to say his name was Tamir, I don't remember for sure. Abul Nakud. Oh no, this one was Tamir. I don't remember the other one though. Um, I don't remember this guy's name. That might have been, that actually might have been William. No, that's Majdadin. Not touchy Majd. Not touchy, dude. I said, stop touchy. Really, stop it. I mean, you will forever live on in the, uh, in the genes of your descendants. Alright, there goes William de Montferrat, I think. And Robert de Salle. Fitting that he was the last. And unfortunately, the illusion was dropped. They were just normal people. Knowing that death isn't the end. When do the angel wings pop out? <laughs> uh... Future games. I am not afraid. Prove it. What could I possibly fear? Look at the power I command. Oh, fun. Come on. You know what? Jesus. Okay. No touchy. Let's see if I can do this the right way. Nope. That's not going to happen. Come on. Damn it, Altair. Come on. Oof. Okay, yeah. Just doing it that way isn't going to work. Have you 
Any final words? You lied to me. Called Robert's goal foul when all along it was yours as well. I've never been much good at sharing. You won't succeed. Others will find the strength to stand against you. And this is why, so long as men maintain free will, there can be no peace. I killed the last man who spoke as such. Bold words, boy. But just words. Then let me go. I'll put words into action. <laughs> Tell me, Master. Why did you not make me like the other assassins? Why allow me to retain my mind? Who you are and what you do are twined too tight together. To rob you of one would have deprived me of the other. And those Templars had to die. <sighs> but the truth is, I did try. In my study, when I showed you the treasure. But you are not like the others. You saw through the illusion. Illusion? That's all it's ever done. This Templar treasure, this piece of Eden, this word of God. Do you understand now? The Red Sea was never parted. Water never turned to wine. It was not the machinations of Iris that spawned the Trojan War, but this! Illusions! All of them! What you plan is no less an illusion. To force men to follow you against their will. Is it any less real than the phantoms the Saracens and Crusaders follow now? Those craven gods who retreat from this world that men might slaughter one another in their names? They live amongst an illusion already. I'm simply giving them another. One that demands less blood. At least they choose these phantoms. Or do they? Aside from the occasional convert or heretic? It isn't right. Ah. And now logic has left you. In its place, you embrace emotion. I am disappointed. What's to be done, then? You will not follow me, and I cannot compel you. And you refuse to give up this evil scheme. It seems, then, we are at an impasse. No, we are at an end. I will miss you, Altair. You were my very best student. Let's go, bitch. Alt here, dodge, man. Oh, helps if I'm holding the right button, doesn't it? Where are you, bitch? Come on. There you are. Ah, there you are. Find the glow of the apple and you find the bitch. Nope. Come on. My blade is forming on the it cuts through the darkness. I mean, not when he's trying to use the illusion machine to literally take over the world and enthrall everybody to his own mind. So it seems. You have won then. Go and claim your prize. You held fire in your hand, old man. It should have been destroyed. Destroy the only thing capable of ending the Crusades and creating true peace? Never. Then I will. We'll see about that. Ancestors' memory synchronized. And to know now recording. And folly. I perceive that this also was a chasing after wind. For in much wisdom, is much grief. And he that increaseth knowledge increaseth sorrow. 
The truth of the matter is the pieces of Eden do a lot more than just illusions. Um, they seem as illusions, however, they also merely... They also affect the world around them. To the point where he could literally hold Altair physically in place with the thing, even though it's an illusion. It's just that the human mind is so primitive compared to the Isu, or the first ones, the people who created this orb, that it's hard to, it's hard for us to comprehend it beyond illusions. I, Australia, I can't. Japan, you can't, China, Russia, India, bunch in the Middle East, bunch in Africa, bunch in Europe. America, South North America, South America, Central America. We've got it. Some land masses that don't exist in anymore in real life. was that well we've got the map how many at least half a dozen we don't need them all we should assume some amount of decay i can't imagine they'll all still be functioning at least two appear to reside on land masses that no longer exist we'll dispatch teams to each site and determine viability we only need one after all what about the rest collect them let's not leave anything to chance Last thing we need is some damn survivor making trouble for us in the new world. And the assassin? We have what we need. Kill him. Wait. Yep. You know how these things work. I doubt we'll be able to walk right in. What's your point? We might need him. His memories. I'd recommend we hold him until we have confirmation that there aren't any surprises waiting for us at the sites. This is a waste of time. You said it yourself. We shouldn't leave anything to chance. Very well sure we have no further need of him, then kill him. Fine. And Stop there they go. undermining my authority! I just saved your ass. Let's go. We've got a lot of work to do. Don't get too comfortable, Mr. Miles. We'll be back for you soon enough. Yeah. What the hell is Ooh. that? Lucy showing up as blue, Vidic showing up as red, and a bunch, a bunch of various symbologies. There have been a couple of times, <laughs> Illuminati, the devil, I mean... Yeah, version of the L seeing eye there, a bunch of codes and stuff like that. Uh, over there is the, uh, oh, what is it called? The Eye of Horus, I want to say. Um, there's some stuff in there. Various drawings and everything, and, uh, yeah. Various symbols. Um, yeah. Yeah. Desmond couldn't do that before. He couldn't do that before. He can now. Because anytime I would push the button that I'm pushing to go do that, it would go into first person view, but it would not show that. So, you know. Dun dun dun. Are you sure Charmed didn't take it from somewhere, though? Because each of these symbols, or at least most of them, exist in, like, various mythology and stuff. I have done the research. There's a few that they made up specifically for this. Some codes and stuff that are specific to uh, the game. But, um... 
Yeah, uh, to be fair, that's how a lot of people first learn some stuff. But yeah, so like, I don't remember what it is, but this like decodes to something kind of series of numbers and letters. Um, there's the all-seeing eye with an apple on the top of it, or a pyramid with an apple on the top of it. Um, up here is... Hold on, let me get a better angle. Various triangles and stuff. So, was the so finishing your thought, your statement about charmed, or was that leading into a question? Yonaguni, Yonaguni, Yonaguni. Okay, finishing your statement. A uh, ziggurat of some sort. You know, I don't think this stuff, these symbols were drawn in ink. Whoever put these here was not in ink. Hey look, a barcode. If you guys want to actually... <laughs> I mean, chances chances are it's blood. In fact, I know it is blood. But like... Yeah. Um, if you guys want to know more about what the symbols are and stuff, they have a... I, I'm pretty sure they have a whole wiki page on the Assassin's Creed wiki dedicated to it. Um, just be careful about potential spoilers for future stuff if you don't, if you care. Oh my god. It looks like, is that blood? What the hell were they keeping here before me? And what happened to them? What does it mean, I wonder? And we're done. <laughs> Sprays enzyme cleaner. Um, I, I could have taken, I think I could have taken a second and gone back through the computers and um, read, uh, checked for some more emails, but I'm pretty sure that there are no more emails. Um, while that's running, let me So yeah, that was Assassin's Creed 1. Uh, for those of you who have seen multiple streams or are watching on YouTube and have seen all the previous ones, thank you for sticking with me. For any new viewers who are, who are watching this one, uh, go check out the rest of them. They're in a playlist available on my YouTube, which is in my link tree down below. Uh, there's also uh, a playlist, I think is what they call them. Collection, no, collection is the term. They, there's a collection of my past streams on the actual um, all weird, weird Ill Illuminati stuff and weird ending, all weird, weird. Yeah, it's like it's supposed to be a cliffhanger to, to, uh, to start an entire series of games that, de that dedicated in, are dedicated towards this. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so, um, yeah, there's a collection of all my previous streams if you missed them, uh, or want to go back and rewatch them. Uh, next week. I may have to start a little bit late last, next week because I have an appointment in the morning and I don't know how long it'll take. Um, but the... Uh, so I may start a little bit late. Uh, hopefully no later than three, but I will play it by ear. Um, but next week I will be starting Assassin's Creed 2. Um, and... Uh, yeah. Excitement abounds. Continuing the story of uh, Desmond and his ancestors. And figuring out what some of these symbols mean or who left them behind and the Templars and the Assassins and all of that jazz. Um, I mentioned it in my Discord, but I'm, I'm hoping, I'm thinking about doing 
because uh, Yvonne had brought it up last stream, a uh, a video, I'm thinking about doing a video that's kind of like an, a post-game analysis or discussion or uh, Q&A thing. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what it is yet. I haven't decided. It won't be, imme it won't be done immediately, but it'll be done. I will do one for each individual game. I, if I do one, I will do one for each individual game, I should say. Um, and then I will not likely stream them here. They will probably post them on YouTube uh, because I can go on for hours about this shit. And if I was just left to um, left to my devices on a stream, then I would bore the hell out of everybody. <laughs> so on YouTube gives me the opportunity to edit myself down and, you know, keep myself in line. <laughs> um, but, uh, yeah. After the credits, I believe it does dump me back into, uh, into Desmond, so I can quickly check the computers to confirm that there is indeed no more, uh, emails. In fact, actually, actually, I might, uh, there is a few, a little bit of extra stuff after the credits. Nothing important, but a little bit of extra stuff after the credits, which I will be getting to in a second. Uh, actually, very quick second because I think these are the end of the. This is the end of the credits. Yes, it is. All right. So, yep, I can still see these things. Yay! I wonder. Is there any of it in the bathroom? Okay, good. He left the bathroom sanitary. Because I mean, if they, if or whoever cleaned the bathroom, cleaned it up much better than they did the rest of the place. Um, all right. Can I mess with this book? No? Okay. Darn. Well, they left. The door is still open. It didn't immediately lock... Desmond, come on. It didn't immediately lock me away like it usually does. Uh, that is still red, so that means it'll probably not let me through. But hey, one can hope. Nope. Okay. Um... I could go back in the Animus. Um, it's made so that I can go back in and do any of the other things that, I, like the side things that I uh, didn't do. Uh, any of the previous missions or things um, that I left undone for, to com basically it's made so that I can go back in and anything I didn't complete on the memory sequences, I can complete now if I wanted. Um, let's check Lucy's computer. However, I completed it all, so I don't need to do that. You just have to check the computers and then We'll be calling it done. Oh, hey, it is 5 o'clock. Well, all right. Um, okay, September 4th and stuff. That was all old stuff. Outbox. Uh, oh, she does have a new email uh, as of the, seven, of the 7th, which is actually today. <laughs> Lucky happenstances. I, honest to God, did not plan that. I could not have planned that because I had no idea how long this shit would take. Uh, <laughs> But yeah, dun dun dun. <laughs> yeah. Um. So apparently today, but pre twelve twenty twelve, um, was when uh, Desmond com uh, found the uh, the stuff. Well, I'll I'll mess with that in a second. Let me, uh, let me confirm. Uh, case file. Yeah. No, we've seen that. Deleted items. This is the, this is the coded emails that uh we talk uh, talked about before that got all the assass that got like six assassins or seven assassins. They said. Uh, killed, and supposedly that's the last of them. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, so yeah, that just leaves this the last one. Okay, so that's a number. Um, scrolling down. Alright. Uh, to Lucy from Warren, conference room door isn't working. Uh, remote access is down or something. Can you look and see what's wrong? I don't have time for this crap. Uh, from Lucy to Warren... Hi, Warren. The passcode has changed, was changed last night. They change them once a week. Do you have the new passcode? From Warren to Lucy. No, what is it? And then Lucy replies with that number. Luckily, I don't need to remember it because they don't actually make me type it in. So that it now gives me access to that door, the conference room door. And we'll go in there and check it in a second. Let me see if there's anything new on Vidic's computer. Squeaky, 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 squeaky. 
All right. Uh, ooh, September 8th, September 7th, September 7th. Uh, I believe September 6th was the pre was the last stuff we had back. Okay. Deleted items. Uh, September 3rd, September 4th. I know what you're doing. Uh, conference room door, September 7th. Okay, so that was the same email. Uh, there is something from September 8th. We'll get to that. Apparently the 8th is actually the day that that happened. So I'm still a little bit early, but whatever. 7th, 8th, eh, close enough. Anyway, uh, then those are from the 3rd about Lucy's friends. Okay, 6, 6, 7. Here we go. Start here. Uh, from Alan Riken, who we know from other emails or have gathered from uh other emails that he is the big boss or at least one of the big bosses ahead uh, above vidic the scientist who was supervising this warren if this kid isn't going to get us what we need it's time to start looking elsewhere i've i've cc'd david from our acquisitions department <sighs> uh he may be able to provide you with a couple of additional test subjects should desmond be retired the double speak uh, in case you need reminding, we are running out of time. This crap with the fluoride enhancement is going to put us under a lot of scrutiny. We need to launch on the 21st. If we wait any longer, we risk everything being frozen during the investigation. I have a feeling that none of our friends in D.C. are going to do us any favors on this one. We'll deal with them come election time. We've cleaned up the mess at D.I.A., but I'm hearing there's some jackass baggage handler trolling news groups and nut job websites with his tales of mass murder and corporate cover ups. Where is he even getting his information from? Your report said the project lead killed everyone down there before our cleanup crews arrived. I still don't understand how they managed to botch that so badly. Talking about the Denver International Airport incident where they blamed it on fluoride and stuff like that. Um, Apparently, there was some big massacre that happened there after while they were investigating. Uh, there was some big mis some big mishap and apparently a massacre that happened there uh, while they were experimenting with one of these pieces of Eden in order uh, in prep for launching it into orbit. Essentially, they were going to put it on a satellite and launch it into orbit and attempt to you know control the world. Anyway. Um, Anyway, we're trying to figure out who the hell he is so we can shut him up, but it's proving difficult. I'm beginning to wonder if he doesn't have help. Seems there are still a couple of those assassin bastards running loose. Uh, it only takes one, but you already knew that. Makes me wonder if the fluoride leak was internal after all, and if it was, are we dealing with a whistleblower or something worse? I'm about, I'm about ready to pull the plug on your Subject 17. So either get me results or get me another person into that animus. Apparently Desmond is subject 17. Um, the, uh, the, uh, what was I about to say? Oh, what was I saying? Um, oh, the, uh, I know email from here. Um, I know that Vidic got. I know what you're doing. I know what you did. I saw him. He had a metal ball. It opened. They went crazy shooting, stabbing, tore each other to pieces. I know it was you people. Saw the logo, heard the name. I'm going to tell anyone who will listen, you'll be exposed. So this email is most likely from the guy that they're hunting down. Um, the person they're hunting down. And, uh, yeah. Uh, so that was that one from Abstergo News Wire Services. Daily headlines. Mexican president promises better border security. Concerned about record numbers of illegal immigrants entering his country, the president of Mexico today promised to ramp up border security. The number of troops stationed along the border is expected to triple. Opponents are worried about an increase in the violence between American refugees and Mexican troops. American refugees. Interesting. Um, fighting between the two groups has left 300 dead and nearly 1,000 wounded over the past six months. Interesting. It's kind of like it's the flip of what's what, you know, actually happens in real life. It has been actually happening in real life. 
Um, next daily headlines. Talks continue regarding aftermath of L11 outbreak. Nearly six years later, after progress, uh, after uh, six years later, little progress has been made in dealing with the repercussions of what history books now refer to as the second plague. With nearly 96% of its population decimated over a three-month period, the continent of Africa is now virtually uninhabited. Plans to drive up the continent have who do, to divide up the continent have met with strong resistance and claims of neocolonialism. Uh, one protester had this to say, whether we are a hundred or a hundred million, this is still our home and no one has the right to take it from us. So in this alternate reality, <laughs> there was an, there was a plague pre-2012 that uh, apparently wrecked the hell out of Africa. And probably has tra has traveled to other parts in the world, which has created American refugees fleeing the country and the like. Yeah. 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 It's like they it's like the people who wrote this game know how the conservative mind works. The, the racism and conservatism that, uh, that, yeah. Yeah. Anyway. So, um, yeah. I actually need to do a little bit of research because, um, because, uh, the assassin, the assass for those of you who don't know, the Assassin's Creed games share the same universe with, numerous other Ubisoft games. Uh, there's the Assassin's Creed series, the Watch Dogs series, um, the, uh, and some of the Tom Clancy games all share the same, the same universe. Um, the, uh, while it's not been explicitly stated about the Tom Clancy ones, there is enough various stuff in specifically in rainbow six siege which is the one uh, which is a game i play regularly where they uh, there's enough environmental stuff that connects the two universes uh, the the two series um for instance you can find the abstergo logo and name in several places across the game uh on numerous things and you can find in there's a couple of places where you can actually find the assassins uh logo the assassins um uh, brotherhood logo on in places uh, in those maps as well um and various things like that um same game and within the tom clancy games siege uh the confirmed ones that share a universe are the rainbow six series the uh division the uh the the ghost recon series um and several others i, I forget them all but there's a lot of, there's a chunk of, of the tom clancy games that are all in the same universe and those ones all uh and so that means that they're all connected to Assassin's Creed, which is connected to uh, Watch Dogs, which has a, has a much more direct connection with the Assassin's Creed games due to um, stuff stated in Assassin's Creed 4 um, and in the first Watch Dogs game. Um, so while... I don't know how much of this continuity stays true across the across it all, or how much how well they maintain the continuity. But in the game, the division, I need to see if they actually say what year the division takes place in, because it might be that this L11 outbreak or the second plague or whatever the fuck that this is talking about is the disease that it, that is what happened that resulted in the division being a big thing in which case 
the division which was previous the actual game plot of the division which was believed to be an alternate reality or some other thing by a lot of people because of how badly it devastates new york and and the and america in general um is possible that it's not as alternate university as it seems so i'll have and 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 you know, those of you who know me, I can't leave that alone. I will be doing research on that for the next six months, probably, to see exactly how it all fits and if it can all actually fit together, etc., etc., etc. So, actually, let me take a screenshot of this so that I don't have to pull it back up later. Uh, get my camera, camera. Very much one of those things where it's like, wow, a little too real. Um, okay, so that was that. We saw those. We saw those. Did we? Oh, oh, oh. We didn't watch that. We didn't see this one. Um, here's the one about the conference room door. Uh, then something, excuse me, something from Lucy about subject number 16. If Desmond is subject 17, then 16 is the one from before, obviously. Sequential. Anyway, from Lucy to Warren. Warren, I've finished my report on Subject 16. You should take a look when you have some time, as I believe it validates my belief that we need to be treating them with greater care. Failure to do so will only result in further breakdowns. I'll summarize things for now, since I realize you're probably pretty busy. Uh, prolonged exposure to the Animus caused, caused a bleeding effect within Subject 16's genetic structure. The result was a blending of genetic and real-time memory. He was unable to distinguish his own life from those of his ancestors, as witnessed with the incident in his room. I believe this effect is, sim is very similar to certain forms of multiple personality and delusional disorders. People who claim to be experiencing past lives or the presence of other minds within their own are quite possibly experiencing a naturally occurring version of this bleeding effect though the specific symptoms may vary from subject to subject. The end result is the same. They lose their minds. This is what I believe happened to Subject 16. One of his ancestors seems to have been involved in an important event in the ancient Far East. The wall writings he left us, the wall writings he left us, defy any conventional explanation, though I'm not ready to dismiss them just yet. Per your request, I've asked for oh yeah. per your request, I've asked for a linguist and historian to research them further in case there is some significance. I'll let you know if they come back to us with anything. I'll get you a full copy of the report so that you can review my findings when you have the time. I know this is not that important to you, Warren, but it would mean a lot to me if you'd just take a look and think about it. We don't have to push them so hard. We don't have to kill them. We don't need to kill them. From a purely practical perspective, there's no point in destroying the subjects anyway. Once they're dead, their knowledge is lost to us forever, and we both know how dangerous that can be. Thanks for your time, Lucy. So Subject 16 was the one who left the writings on the wall in blood, presumably his own. Uh, and the bleeding effect... I don't remember when they explain it, but the bleeding effect is essentially what has allowed Desmond to now use the Eagle Vision ability. So, that's fun. Side effects. They're great, aren't they, Desmond? Anyway, all right, so we now have the code for the conference room door, and we've read emails and stuff, so let's go see what's in here. Maybe it's a way out. Not likely. But maybe. All right, so I'm now in here. Oop, come on. Through the door, Desmond. There you go. All right. Ooh. Actually, those look incredibly comfortable. Sterilized as hell, but, uh, but comfortable. Um, I like that coffee table. I like that coffee table. Um, random storage boxes. Well, there's a... Pan, uh, some kind of panel there, but it the, yeah, won't let me out. Damn it. Okay, there's there is a computer here. Um. Uh, 
Let us see. Sit down. Well, let me log on. Access granted. Welcome project lead number nine. Uh, the uh, password that I just used was the one from that other email, the one with the, there were two passwords that I got from the emails. One was for the door, the other one was for this account. Um, Abstergo email network, uh, inbox for project lead number nine. Um, there's only one email here, nothing in deleted, nothing in outbox, one email from Alan Riken to uh, Warren. Warren, the others and I have finished reviewing the Animus recordings from subjects 12 through 16. While the Peace of Eden remains our priority, we must all continue working to locate and understand the remaining artifacts. I am sure you can understand our reasoning behind this. Although the satellite is intended to accomplish a fair portion of the work for us, we will certainly need to deal with those who are either immune to or protected from its effects, like Altair was. Please take a moment to look over our findings and get back to me with any feedback you may have. I will summarize below. One, Peace of Eden number three. We applaud your continued efforts to locate an alternative, an alternate ar artifact. Yeah, alternate artifact. English is hard, guys. Uh, alternate artifact following the loss of number two in the DIA satellite incident, uh, Denver International Airport satellite incident. Um, we understand... Subject 17 is having trouble interfacing with the Animus, leading to delays. As a result, we estimate another 24 hours before our next critical update. In the meantime, we're relying on you to obtain the additional information we require. He knows where the other objects are, even if he doesn't realize it. He must unlock that final memory, or all of this will have been for nothing. Number two, the Philadelphia Project. Data provided from Animus Subject 12 indicates that the ship briefly manifested in a indicates that the ship briefly manifested in a future state for pro approximately 18 minutes. Interesting. It is unclear whether the timeline is consistent with or parallel to our own. Although we have recovered enough data to reconstruct and repair the original artifact used in the experiment. Administration has refused to move forward on the project, citing paradox concerns. Corporate policy remains in place. Any objects found to, inter to interfere with or manipulate time must be contained. Artifact will be, will be moved to secure storage. So there is an artifact that appears to affect the timeline. Go figure. Uh, number three, the Tunguska incident. Now believed to be the direct result of assault of assault by assassins, English, research station destroyed, as was artifact. Alternate wave generation devices have been wow he okay. Alternate wave generation devices have been located in storage, but we have insufficient data at the moment to initiate research. The risk of accident is too high. Lineage discovery and lineage discovery and acquisition division should attempt to locate descendants of any attack survivors, either assassins, assassin or or brotherhood. Interesting that they have that separated, considering the assassins brotherhood. I think they mean. I, I think that should be or order, because it's the assassins brotherhood and Templar order, but. Or unless there's a third thing that I'm forgetting. I don't think there is. Anyway, in order to continue research, uh, research uh, re resurrecting this particular type of technology will aid us greatly with any holdouts following the satellite's activation. We're putting together a team to push research in this area. Four, the grail. We are removing the grail from our list of objectives. There is insufficient evidence to confirm its existence. Current examination of Subject 17 indicates that aside from the Peace of Eden, all other artifacts related to Christ figure are literally uh, are literary devices or derived from Pieces of Eden, and not actual objects. Even if the object is real, its use to us at this stage is negligible. Our research, our resources are better used elsewhere. Templars and the Holy Grail kind of go hand in hand. You can't mention the one without having the other, apparently. <clears throat> Mitchell Hodges com uh, communicators. 
an analysis of our of the ob oh my god analysis of the objects is complete the good news is that they work as a result we now have a safe and secure communication channel for use after the launch however they are severely limited in number and so we will be providing them only to our most essential fa uh, facilities you will obviously retain possession of the one you have Warren, I cannot stress how important it is that you wrap things up with se Subject 17 as soon as possible. We are obviously relieved that you seem to be closing in on the target memory, but you need to step it up. Everything we're working towards depends on your retrieving those locations. Without them, we've got nothing. May the Father of Understanding guide you to success. A.R., which is Alan Riken. Well... That's all the emails and everything. All the doors. Are there any symbols in here? Nope. We've officially seen all that there is to see within this game. Well, more or less. So yeah. All right. It's actually almost 5:30. Which means we went an hour over, which makes sense, I guess. Sucks. Not, not eh, actually, that doesn't suck. We had fun. We had fun, and that's what matters. Um, why does that show is incomplete? Oh, there we go. Assassinate memory complete. Okay, okay, okay. New attachment. My master. Ooh, I don't think I've ever read this one before. Uh, my master is dead, and many more with him, friend and foe alike. But the storm is broken. Though pride may hold the clouds aloft a little longer, of this much, I am certain, with Robert and al Mualim dead, the Saracen and Crusader armies will lay down their arms and give up this senseless war. Freed from the manipulations and schemes of wicked men, uh, Salid Saladin and Richard will find they have more in common than they think. Peace will return to the land, and if they should stray once more, then my brothers and I will do what needs to be done to set things right. To set things aright, Masayef is quiet now, caressed by the winds which carry through the valley. What is this thing I hold that I that it can bend men's minds? Uh, uh, no larger than an apple, yet it yet its power greater than any weapon I've known. I have seen what evil even the smallest taste brings. I should destroy it. Yet something stays my hand. No, I will hold it a little while longer and see what it may teach me. Perhaps it can be turned to good. Or is this what the others thought when they held it? Is that its power? Is, it, is that its power, then, to turn the noble into cruel? I know not what the future holds for any of us, but I do know those assassins who remain will need guidance. I must attend to them, help to heal their wounds. We will march together into the future and emerge stronger than we were before. If we are to succeed, if we are to rebuild, then we must be careful not to repeat the mistakes of those who came before. We must be vigilant, ever mindful of the past. All right. I have never read that before, so that was exciting. All right. Uh, it's 5.30, which means um, our time is up, especially because there's no more game to play. Uh, <laughs> remember that a recording of the stream will be going up on YouTube, hopefully no later than tomorrow morning. Um, and if you're watching this on YouTube, then like and subscribe if you enjoyed this. And check out the, if you missed any of the previous streams or want to watch them again, they're in a playlist on, uh, on my channel. Um, tune in Tune in next week, approximately the same time. I mentioned before that we'd be playing it by ear, given the fact that I have an early, I have a morning appointment and I don't know how long that will take. Uh, but st st stay tuned to my social media or my Discord or whatever for more information um, on that. Um, it, I will say that if it gets later than like 3:30 or so, I might we probably will just we might just cancel next week. I don't know. Hopefully not. Hopefully there will be no delay. Hopefully I will be able to start at 2.30 p.m. U.S. Central Time next week, like usual. Um, however, we don't know, so we'll see. Um, every Friday afternoon, uh, my friend Yvonne streams random games. If she is still still with us, uh, she might be able to... 
tell us more about that. Otherwise, she's been mostly doing Animal Crossing. Although, actually, no, that's a lie. Uh, she's been doing Tales of Symphonia le recently. Although last week she took a, she took the week off and had and her boyfriend Howie instead played Factoria for the time. So it's one or the other. You'll see. It depends on how she feels. It depends on how they feel, etc. Um, so check her out on her Twitch channel. The link will be in the, the link to her channel is in my uh, is in my link tree down below. Um, also, my friend Matt has started streaming on Twitch as well. I believe he tries to do uh, Tuesday and or Wednesday nights, um, and also possibly Sundays. No, maybe I don't know. Um, I think he tries to do like every other Sunday and then possibly Tuesday and Wednesday. I'm not sure, um, but he's been playing mainly Stardew Valley, uh, Stardew Valley, and uh, what's that? Subnautica. However, I think he's actually completed Subnautica except for a couple of things, uh, which he might be getting to this week. Um, Hi. Oh, there is an Avon. She lives. I've been here for a bit. I'm surprised you didn't notice. I have Discord minim uh, minimized, so I can actually be focusing on the chat and uh, stuff. Sorry. Yeah. I think Matt does Monday and Wednesday. Monday is his Stardew Valley day. Wednesday is his... Is... Oh, so he might be on later tonight, then. Yeah. Okay, and, okay. And yeah, on I thought, I thought it was Fridays Tuesday, because right that way he doing... didn't... It doesn't matter, what? it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. What? Follow Matt, and, his, no. and whenever he's online, you'll get notified for it. Anyway, you were saying, Yvonne. Carry on. And um, on Fridays, I'm doing uh, Tales of Symphonia with Howie, if I don't end up feeling like poop. And on Sundays, I'm doing Animal Crossing, where we're touring other people's islands. But like normal people, not like people that are like, oh, I've been in a magazine for how gorgeous my island is. So, you know, relatable stuff. That reminds me, have you seen... I'll ask you later. Um, the, uh... Yeah, so... Uh, what, day, what day did you say that was going to be? That you were going to start doing that? I do that on Sundays now. Sundays. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, do you have any specific name that you're going to be doing? Is it going to be, like, one a day? Or, like, um... Different people, different... Uh, different people, mul uh, multiple peoples on each day. It's one person a day right now. Okay. Okay. Do you have Do you have a name? Uh, do you just get the Do you contact him ahead of time and be like, Hey, can I do Can I tour your island for my thing, or do you just like randomly go to a thing and randomly go to somebody's island? I contact them and they're actually in the voice chat, giving a uh, commentary and their thoughts on their island as we tour around. Awesome. Uh, so, who are you? Can you say their name or maybe their screen name or something like that so that you don't like fully out them on the internet? Just to give people yeah, a no taste? problem. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Yvonne immediately just... starts digging for information. I am digging for information. How could you tell? Gosh, I text way too many people for the sake of sanity. It's all good. No, it's not. I mean, it is, though. Central's here somewhere. Aha! So, the upcoming stream on the 13th, Sunday the 13th, we're going to Jen's island, and her island is themed around places she wants to go when COVID is over. One of which is Disney World. So I'm excited. Awesome. Awesome. So yeah, stop by Yvonne's channel. Um, did you say a time for that other than Sunday? One o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time. All right. So stop by Yvonne's channel, Yvonne B. Uh, she's been in the chat this entire time. Um, so you may have seen her username pop up a few times on on video or in the chat. Um, and uh, so stop by her channel around that time to check that out. Um, I probably will too. I don't know. We'll see. I'll um, do it now. All right. See you, Evan. Thanks for stopping in. No problem. Uh, Bye. So yeah, Evan. Sunday, uh, Sunday afternoon, we'll be doing that. 
Um, Matt will be streaming either tonight or tomorrow and Wednesdays, uncertainly. Uh, I'm uncertain. Um, check out his uh, his channel. I don't th I don't know if he has a uh, his actual schedule up, um, but at the very least, if you follow him, then you'll get the notify a notification when he's on. Um, he might be on later tonight. I don't know, but check him out. Uh, he's great, as are, as is Avon. And um, another friend of mine, Eternity, streams. Uh, Eternity's End. He streams uh, uh, pretty often. Um, just he's. He, I don't think he has a schedule. He just does it whenever, whenever the hell he uh, feels like it, um, or has the time or whatever. Um, he's been, he plays a lot of random games too. Like I've seen him play Star Wars: The Old Republic and. Uh, Final Fantasy VII Remake and uh, a bunch of other random games. Um, so check him out. Um, also, I have a uh, new-ish friend, I mentioned her last week, uh, named Cosplay Katie. Uh, she streams on Twitch, um, and uh, she, has, she has an Instagram and a Twitter where she displays her uh, various cosplays and stuff. She's got. She's done um, Witcher cosplays. Um, she's done a. She's done a Harley Quinn. She's done a few others. She's really good. Um, she's awesome. Uh, so check her out. Um, she mainly streams World of Warcraft, I believe. Uh, so if you're into that, go check her out. It's cosplay Katie, one word. Um, K A T I E. Um, and yeah. Uh, or if you're too lazy to do to check out Yvon, Matt, or Eternity, or anything like that, I host them here, so that you can just check them out here whenever they're live. Um, and I think that's it. I think. Maybe. I said the thing about the Twitch. Sorry, I just threw a thing that I was... I threw my fidget spinner. Yes, I have a fidget spinner. <laughs> um... The, uh, I said the thing about the Twitch channels, I said next week, yeah, um, oh, last bit, the most important bit, I forgot the most important bit, this is very important, so pay attention, you matter, never forget that, you matter, you are important, you are loved, and you deserve love. Especially with how shitty everything has been lately. You have to take care of yourself. It's dark. It's gloomy. It's depressing. It's upsetting. It's just... With all of the police brutality, with COVID, with everything. Mental health is at an all-time low. You have to take care of yourself. Take time off from things that you need if you need to. Social media, streaming, fighting for your right to live, whatever it is, taking time off from it for your own mental health is a good thing. Take care of yourself. Your physical and mental health matters. If you need them, I have crisis resources available in my link tree. Uh, links to resources such as for, uh, suicide prevention, substance abuse, Domestic abuse, sexual assault, um, I don't remember what all I have in there, but I know I have those ones in there. Please, please check them out if you need to. If you're in another, unfortunately those are for United States only, I believe. Um, however, I am pretty certain I, that outside of the United States, each has their own as well. Um, for the most part, probably. You can... Likely, you can Google them and see what you... Uh, if you need them, Google them if you're outside of the United States. Um, the uh, They are there. They can help if you need it. If you need help, ask for help. Um, wear a mask, wash your hands, keep, six, keep at least six feet away from each other uh, because COVID-19 is still here. And it's, it's getting worse and worse and worse and worse. Um, black lives matter. All cops are bu are bastards. LGBTQ plus rights are human rights. Love yourself and love everyone around you. And I will see you next time. If not next week, the week after. Take care of yourselves. Peace.